Mr. Panganiban was prescribed by his therapist a phenylcine for his depression. Dispensed without an intervention by the pharmacist, Mr. Panganiban weren't given caution on what he should or should not take when in medication. Unknown to him, drinking milk and eating dairy products such as cheese can lead to a hypertensive crisis on patients taking MAO inhibitors, such as phenylcine. Thus, he was rushed to the hospital. According to the Institute of Medicine report, medical errors cause as many as 44,000 to 98,000 deaths each year. Just as in the case of Mr. Panganiban, his daughter didn't know that he is taking antidepressant, so she wasn't able to answer the doctor's queries regarding how the incident transpired. Calling on the community pharmacy that dispensed the drug without a patient medication record, the pharmacist wasn't able to identify which drug had caused the hypertensive crisis. Patient medication records helps preventing medication error by keeping track on every drug, prescriptions or non-prescription, supplements and herbal medicines that the patients are taking. In cases of emergency or even visiting a new doctor, a completed medication record assures that the healthcare providers have accurate information regarding medications that the patient is taking. Patient medication record helps patient and their family remember what medications they are taking, provides doctors current list of all your medications, concerns may be found and prevented by knowing what medication is being taken. Pharmacists could find all information about patient condition, diseases, and used medicines. It will also facilitate hospital-community pharmacy interaction as two different institutions directly responsible for the treatment of the patients. Hello? Lumus Pharmacy? This is Dr. Season. Meron ba kayong prescription medication record ni Mr. Ian Panganiban? Ah, sige, wait lang po. Mm, phenylcine po yung last prescription niya. Ah, okay, yung antidepressant. Meron pa ba siyang ibang gamot na iniinom? Mm, Centrum po, yung iba niyang iniinom. Other than that, wala na pong ibang contraindicated sa phenylcine. Ah, ganun ba? Mas malinaw na ngayon. Salamat!